Welcome to the DRB3 Enhanced Emulator video. DRB3 Enhanced Emulator is the current version of the DRB3 emulator. A Micropod 2 device with serial letters starting with WSP is required to use DRB3 Enhanced Emulator. DRB3 Enhanced Emulator supports Chrysler Group Legacy OBD2 J1962 vehicles and the Legacy Bus ECUs on the ZB Viper, CS Pacifica, ZH Crossfire, KJ Liberty, PT, PT Cruiser, and the DR SRT-10 Ram. For additional details, see our Diagnostic Tool Reference Charts in the Ytech Knowledge Base. Links to these articles can be found in the video description. DRB3 Enhanced Emulator is launched from the Ytech 1 Windows Desktop application. Connect the Micropod 2 to the vehicle. The Micropod 2 can connect to the DRB3 Enhanced Emulator application via USB or via Wi-Fi. If connecting via Wi-Fi, verify both the Micropod 2 and PC are on the same Wi-Fi network. The Launch DRB3 Enhance button does not appear until a Micropod 2 is selected in vehicle selection. Double check the Launch DRB3 Enhanced button is selected in Ytech 1, not just the Launch DRB3 button. If you're only getting the Launch DRB3 button, verify you're using a WSP Micropod 2, not a WCP Micropod 2, a Ytech VCI Pod, or a Star Mobile device. If the Launch DRB3 Enhance button does not appear in Ytech when selecting your WSP Micropod 2, please call the Ytech Premium Support Help Desk to verify licensing on the Micropod 2. Select the Micropod 2 device in Vehicle Selection then select Launch DRB3 Enhanced. Agree to the EULA and the DRB3 Enhanced Emulator is launched. The following is a short demo of reading DTCs. and a short demo of viewing data. And running an actuator. And running a routine. For a How to Flash with DRB3 Emulator, please see the How to Flash with DRB3 Emulator video linked here. Thanks for watching. For additional information and support, consult the Ytech Knowledge Base or contact Ytech Support.